Hello, sisters. Moon title here with the Women's Wellness Circle, and it is November 3rd, uh, 2020, um, the eve of a very big presidential election here in the U.S. And yeah, I'm just wanting to check in with all of you, um, especially those sisters um, in the U.S., but also any sister in the world who's feeling impacted um, by the US election, um, just to see how you're doing and uh, what you're feeling and how you've been journeying through the day. And I wanna invite you to just take a few moments kind of wherever you are to just breathe with me. Um, sometimes I find it really helpful to breathe with other people. So in a moment, we're just gonna breathe together and then after that, I'm just going to share with you kind of how I've been journeying through today. And, and then um, we're going to close by um, filling our hearts with love and sending love um, all over the U.S. and extending that out all over to the world. Okay, so let's just close our eyes for just a few moments and drop down into your pelvis, into your legs, and really send your roots down, deep down through all the layers of floor, chair, bed beneath you. Sending your roots down into Mother Earth, traveling through layers of rock and soil and water, expanding and growing wider until they find their resting place held deep within Mother Earth. From this place, let's just breathe together. If you're feeling alone right now, letting your eyes come open so that you can see me. And just let's take a few breaths together. Receive a few breaths together. As you breathe, just reminding yourself, you are love. You are loved. And as you breathe, breathing in, I am love. Breathing out, I am loved. And just really receiving these breaths into your heart. As I'm breathing, I'm sending love to each and every one of you. Continuing to breathe. Making sure to breathe out and breathe in. And just simply acknowledging your heart. Acknowledging your womb space or the space your womb would be if it were still in your body. Acknowledging your feet that walk this beautiful earth and your hands that help you to touch life. And just checking in, how are you? How have you been journeying through today? What do you need? What would you like to let go of? As for me, I've been deeply rooted in my work today. Um, I actually haven't, I really didn't know how I was gonna journey through today. I mean, I knew I was gonna work, um, but I started the day with a long, beautiful walk. We've had a dusting of snow and the road was a bit icy. The sun was out, the sky was a beautiful blue. And then I um, 
had my first session. And one thing that's happened in all the sessions today has been some really powerful ancestral work. That's been coming a lot this week, not surprisingly. Um, and I had a really nourishing meal. And I worked through the whole day and then I've just been sitting and breathing. And that's when I wanted to reach out and connect with all of you. And I don't know how I'm gonna journey into the evening. Um, I know that I'm gonna have a nourishing supper and I haven't decided if I'm gonna check in with the news or not. Um, when I finished work today, I began to feel a lot of aberrant energies moving through me and I went outside to clear center and ground and be with the fresh air, be with the sky and be with the lake and to root and ground and kind of move through these waves and sensations of energy. And so I just wanted to come on and say hello and um, see how you are and breathe a little bit together. And then let's just take our hearts that we've just settled as we've rooted and grounded into Mother Earth and into our own breath. And let's just send love. Let's just send love through the entire United States. Let's send a prayer for healing and a prayer for authentic unity. And let's let the love from our hearts reach out and wash through, wash through the entire United States touching every living human, every plant, tree, animal, landscape, ocean, river, mountain. From there, let's expand the love of our hearts out to suffuse the entire planet. As we journey through these big times, may each and every one of us be held in love. May the power opportunity, powerful opportunities for healing flowing through this time be felt and tended to by each and every one of us. And may we all have what we need on each step of the journey. Tomorrow, those of us in the US will wake to another layer of this journey. Perhaps we'll know tonight. However it is, however we are, let us stay grounded in our love for ourselves, for each other, and for life herself. Good night, sisters. <laughs>